Hey guys, welcome to the video today. In today's video, I am going to go through the setup process and review this Logitech M510 Comfort Mouse. But before I begin, I wanted to let you know to make sure that you're wearing the proper safety equipment and take all safety precautions while you're going through the setup process and while you use this mouse. Okay, so first let's take a look at all the different sides of the box. So here is this side here, and then here is this side here, and here is this side here, and then here is this side, and here is this side. And make sure that you read through all of this information before you do take the mouse out of the box. Okay, so let's take the mouse out of the packaging here. I'm just going to take the sticker off here. So right here on the packaging, it is giving us some information about the mouse. Um, here's this information here. And then when we move this uh, flap here, here is some additional information here. And let's take the mouse out here. Okay, so here is some important safety compliance and warranty information and make sure that you read through all of this information before you do go through the setup process or use the mouse. And then let's take the mouse out of the packaging here. And I'm just going to set it right here for now. And if you have the ability to, you can recycle both the box and this packaging here. Okay, so my first impression on this mouse is that it looks like it's a really nice mouse. And to show you some of the features here, it has the left button here and the right button here. And then we have the scroll wheel, which goes up and then also down and then also left and right. You can move it left and right and you can hear it click. Like when you go left, you can hear it click. And when you go right, you can hear it click. And then we have the buttons on the side here. And just overall, in my opinion so far, it looks like a nice mouse. And there's also a middle button on the scroll wheel. And then let's take a look at the bottom of the mouse. Here is the bottom of the mouse. It's currently in the on position. So I'm going to turn that to the off position. And then it has this piece here that we can take out so the batteries can make contact with the mouse. Uh, but I'm going to wait on that. And here is the invisible optic, and you want to make sure that you never point this at yourself or at any other living thing. All right, guys, so the mouse is turned off, and now I'm going to remove this piece here. So I'm just going to hold on to the mouse with this hand and then gently pull this piece out like so. Okay, so next we want to make sure that the mouse is turned off and then I'm going to remove the battery cover. I'm just placing my thumb here and then gently sliding the battery cover downwards until it comes off and then we'll just set this to the side for now. And then here is the Logitech USB unifying receiver. So I'm going to remove that and we'll just set this to the side for now. And then here is a pull tab for when you do need to replace the batteries when they go bad. Um, you're able to use this to help get the batteries out of the battery compartment. And now I'm going to take the battery cover and line this back up like so and then just push up until it snaps back into place like so. Alright guys, so let me get rid of this and then I'll be back and we'll set up the Logitech M510 Comfort Mouse on my laptop. All right, guys, and the next thing that I'm going to do is to turn the mouse on. And when you do this, just like I said earlier, you want to make sure that you do not point the invisible optic at yourself or at anyone else. So I'm going to turn the mouse on and then just turn the mouse back over and move it out of the way a little bit. And then I'm going to take the Logitech USB unifying receiver and install this into one of the USB ports on my laptop. And when you do this, you want to make sure that you install this the correct direction and all the way into place. And you may get a message on your laptop or computer letting you know that it is setting up a new device. 
And you may also get a notification on your laptop or computer letting you know that that device has been set up. And after a little while, you can test the mouse out and see if it's working. All right, and when you're all done using the mouse, don't forget to turn it off. And like I said earlier, you wanna make sure that you don't point the invisible optic at yourself or at anyone else. So I'm just going to turn the mouse over and then turn it off and then just turn the mouse back over. And you can use the scroll wheel to go up and down on a page if it's longer than the screen or to go left or right on a page if it's longer than the screen. Okay, so the two buttons on the side and then the left, the right, and the middle buttons on the scroll wheel can be programmed. So Logitech offers two different softwares on the official Logitech website. One of them is called Logitech Options and one of them is called Logitech Options Plus. And Logitech is the first part of Logitech. So you can download either one of these softwares and if you agree to the terms of the end user license agreement you can install one of those softwares and then you can program the two buttons on the side or the left the right or the middle buttons on the scroll wheel okay so here's what i think about this mouse i actually think it's a really nice mouse it was really comfortable to use I like the feature of the left and the right on the scroll wheel, and I like the fact that it has programmable buttons. And I also think that the setup process was really easy. All right, guys, I hope this video was helpful, and thank you so much for watching. And I do plan on making future videos about the Logitech M510 Comfort Mouse, so if that's something that you're interested in, please check back for those videos. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Have a good one. Thank you guys for watching. Please like, subscribe, and comment, and if you have the time, check out these other great videos.